Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? You can't sleep right now. You gotta wake up. You gotta get up. Don't you know what day it is? It's Copy Cory Sunday. Copy Cory Sunday doesn't happen every other day. I mean, it does on other channels, but at least here we admit it. Anyway. All right, we are actually reacting to scary videos, but I, I'm going to give you a disclaimer. If it's not scary, I'm not going to pretend it is, okay? And a lot of scary YouTube videos are just funny. They're like comedy. So if I if I start laughing at these, don't be mad at me, be mad at the video. Do I just look up scary videos on YouTube? Is that how I find these gems? How does Cory do it? Scary videos. 10 scary videos you won't forget. 10 scary videos too scary for this world. Five scary videos. Ooh, we're changing it. That will scare you stiff. 11 scary videos only a real one can handle. That's me. I'm real. I'm a real one. Only a real one can watch <laughs> these scary videos without getting shook. It's and only the guy. realists can admit when they've gotten way too creeped out. Three friends are exploring an abandoned house and feel like it could be haunted because of how creepy it feels. Number they know 15. there's a ghost in the hall. Burger King foot lettuce. First, a little background information. I worked the night shift at a local gas station when I was 19. I was the only employee in the store, as usual. On Christmas Eve, I had to work the overnight, 10 p.m. into 6 a.m. into Christmas Day. Has anyone else listened to so many creepypastas about the overnight shift that now you kind of want to work one? You just kind of want to experience it yourself? That's what's happened to me. I've watched so many creepypastas and, and scary stories about 3 a.m. I was working the night shift. And I kind of want to work the night shift now. It was a normal night. No customers and my cleaning was almost finished. I had just got done eating and decided to go out for a smoke when I hear someone walking towards the store in the distance. Now, this was nothing out of the ordinary until the person gets to the pumps and I can actually see them. It was a male, about 5'9 and somewhat thin. He was wearing a dark hoodie, jeans, and was carrying a gift bag. That's the weird part? The gift bag's the weird part? Not the fact that he's staring at you? And said, you wanna help? Then don't call the f***ing cops. I agreed and told him that there was a first aid kit inside and that I'd be happy to help him with his wound. Crazy, I know, but I was just trying to be nice to him since he was someone who could be a threat to me. What if I'm now a, a suspect? What if, what if he just murdered somebody and now I'm a suspect in this man's murder because I, I cleaned him up? As I pulled out the stuff for him to clean himself up with, he said he needed to use the restroom and once again told me not to call the cops. He didn't come out, so I went outside and called. The dispatcher told me to stay out of the store and find somewhere safe to be until the officers arrived. Yes, uh, sir, it'd be safe if you uh, exited the gas station with the lights and the uh, safety in. For your safety, sir, you need to stand in the middle of the road. Matter of fact, go, go, uh, travel a little bit into the woods. Don't take any flashlights or phone with you. Just, 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 uh... <laughs> That's the safest place to be right now. See if he came out of the bathroom. He never came out. The police arrived Ooh. and asked where he was. I pointed and they went in. And they found him masturbating. Just as they got to the door, he opened it and tried to lunge at one of the officers. They tackled him, threw a knife that he was holding, and promptly arrested him. As they were walking him out of the store, he told me that I was lucky that the police got there when they did. What? And that he'd see me again soon. I told the officer what had all happened, and then I asked something I really wish I didn't know the answer to. Was he jerking off in the bathroom? What was he doing in the bathroom? <laughs> The officer told me that it was a good thing <laughs> The officer told me they found him on the toilet with his pants down Because the guy had shot up some heroin in the bathroom Then was going to come out with a knife, stab me, and run with what money was in the register That's what the bag was for This guy had a lot of problems and a lot of anger inside of him The reason he was so angry was also the reason his head was bleeding He owed his dealer money and got beat because of it his solution to the problem was robbing the store. The officer told me if I didn't call when I did, I'd either be critically wounded or dead because he wasn't going to allow me to stand between him and that money. I hope I never see that crazy drug addict who wanted to kill me to free himself of debt again. Me too. It was 2.25 a.m. I sat at my laptop aimlessly, scrolling, as the minutes dragged by. 
So far this isn't scary, she's just describing every night in my life. I contemplated crawling into my bed and calling in a night, but my overstimulated brain was still rushing after several hours of scrolling through endless tweets, Does suck. half reading reddit posts, and hitting the next recommended video on YouTube. I eventually found myself in the deadly cycle of switching between the home page and the inbox page on Facebook. Don't use Facebook, I so reached I across the know. table and took a long swig of my now flat Pepsi. Then <laughs> as I This is so far all this is describing uh, that night in my life. This is all this is just what this is describing. Now all that needs to happen is she needs to try to fall asleep but can't as she continues to refresh YouTube trying to see if she's gotten any more likes on her recent video. Then after that finally falls asleep after thinking about her future and what she'll do if YouTube doesn't work out for her. As I was about to stand up, a small square suddenly appeared in the corner of my screen. It was plain white with a red frame with the bold letters flashing from blue to red, reading, This link will disappear in 60 seconds. <laughs> nice try. Probably some low-budget website or internet scam trying to trick me into taking their surveys yes. or giving out my credit card information so that I or can win worse. that free new iPad. The numbers counted down from 40 to just, 39 just to let 38. It, yep. Just let As it the count down. the numbers counted down, my curiosity no, of where that link would no, take me began to grow. That shouldn't, it, it popped up without you even searching anything, that's a bad sign. The box, then no, myself. you see that, no, you, please don't. What if clicking this link would install You'll some die. virus onto my computer? No, it'll be worse than that. Your virus is already here. The best chance you have is not clicking the link. I reached for the top of my screen and began to close yes. it. Yes. What if no. it was the FBI trying to bait me into clicking a link to an illegal website? It, yeah, could be. What if it really was a once in a lifetime opportunity and by clicking <laughs> this link I would get the chance to view something no one has ever seen before? Dude, she's just the kind of person that these, these people that scam websites want to scam. What if this is truly how I meet God? thought of never knowing where that link would take me is going to drive me crazy. Why? And I could surely see myself losing sleep over it. What? I slowly- <laughs> <laughs> Another bad dream about that goddamn 30 second link. I lifted my laptop screen again and saw the numbers count down from 5 to 4 to 3 and click the link just as the timer reached one idiot a new tab appeared on my screen as what looked like now you're gonna have to watch somebody get executed congrats i blinked in confusion as all i saw was a very dark video feed with a blinking red dot in the corner of the screen next to the words live the second figure just stood there unmoving yes then began to sway back and forth the figure behind no longer he's dancing seemed. this continued for another minute he's getting ready to party then it stopped he's amping himself up every so often Whoa. becoming faster and more rapid he's seven a seizure it's your job to save him and you get a, a prize. The other figure. Give him mouth to mouth. Just sat there motionless, as if unaware of what's going on. You're on a game it. show. My heart began to race. Why don't they notice what's going on? <laughs> you see, he's just dancing. I am behind you. I'm gonna stab you. Just when I thought it was about to be all over. The twitching figure stopped, then slowly began to crouch down off camera. It was a test. And I could no longer you see it. From I leaned in closer to the screen to try to get a better view of the mysterious figure in front of me. Then to my surprise, the seated figure leaned in as well. I proceeded to dab on them haters, and to my surprise, the figure followed. I then noticed a small light at 
the top of my computer monitor. A steady That's green light. That's sad that it took her this long to notice that. It was then I noticed that my camera lens was extremely dusty. Then the burglar proceeded to grab a sharp object and forcefully impale me with it. It was two minutes after that I had realized I had been stabbed. I felt my heart begin to race. The figure I've been staring at this whole time was ugly. If this was a recording of me, that means that the figure behind was a recording as well. She's finally caught on. Mind is as sharp as a Nokia phone. I made two mistakes that night, was clicking that link. Now she knows. And the second was looking under my table. Probably when I see that thing under my desk, I'm gonna try to make some compromises. Hold on, before you do anything. I have over 10,000 karma on Reddit. Okay, so we're on that part of the internet. All right. No. Oh. Okay. What is happening? Who made this? Who sat down and made this? <laughs> cool 3D world, wow. One of the most unaccurate titles. Terrifying 3D nightmares is much more suitable. Eyes treated, laptop yeeted, history deleted. Holy water needed. Personal space impeded. Thanos defeated. Girlfriend cheated. All right, well, that was weird note to end it on. So, uh, yeah, give me suggestions on videos that I should watch for my next uh, uh, Copy Cory Sunday. Please do that, though. I really do need content. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Good riddance.